The Valley's largest gathering of HIV advocates comes together this Saturday to walk toward ending the HIV and AIDS epidemics and to promote health equity. I spoke today with the Director of Brand Marketing for DAP Health, Stephen Henke. Stephen, tell us about this year's Desert AIDS Walk. Well, Peter, it's Saturday morning, 7.30 in Ruth Hardy Park, and uh, we're really excited this year. We're excited every year. Uh, this is the event the community looks forward to. Of course, it's a really important event funding healthcare access at DAP Health, uh, but this year it's taken on a more important tone as we set the theme of Walk Out Loud, and we set that in response to what we're seeing all across the country with LGBTQ plus healthcare rights um, under assault in the courts and the legislatures, and of course what we've seen with reproductive rights. Uh, this is a time where uh, everyone needs to use their voice and walk out loud for health equity and healthcare access. And I understand there will be a special postcard signing. Absolutely. We've developed, I think, what is the country's largest postcard. And uh, what we're going to be doing is letting the community write uh, special messages about why healthcare access and equity is so important to them. And then we're going to fold it up and we're going to mail it to the White House as an affirmation for the work they've been doing on our behalf and to make sure that they know that the community of Greater Palm Springs cares about this issue. And this theme of Walk Out Loud will also transcend into Pride next week. That's absolutely right. We're going to take this theme and we're going to literally walk out loud at the Palm Springs Pride Parade. And what we're doing is uh, launching a new campaign for DAP Healthcare, uh, which is called DAP Health is Healthcare. And our uh, contingent will be holding all of the reasons and ways that healthcare is at DAP Health. So you'll see signs that say mental health is healthcare, uh, LGBT care is healthcare, recovery is healthcare, housing is healthcare, so on and so forth. And then we're going to literally walk the walk and talk the talk by bringing the gift of wellness to the LGBTQ community by launching a really big DAP Health Pavilion right at the heart of the festival at the corner of Arenas and Palm Canyon, uh, which will have programming that's free and open to everyone in the community all weekend long from sound baths to lectures to panel discussions to a speed friending uh, opportunity to meet new people and a separate tent just for the recovery community called the Recovery Oasis. A lot going on for anybody who would like to take part in all of these events. What do they need to know? So there's still time to register for the walk and that's desertaidswalk.org. And anybody can come to the walk, even if you're not walking, we'll have over 50 community booths in Ruth Hardy Park uh, before the walk. And you can take part in that access care at the different community partners. We'll have the Palm Springs Animal Shelter adopting dogs. And of course, stay after the walk because at 1030, there's an opportunity to make a splash for health equity by dunking one of our civic leaders. If you wanna participate in Pride, uh, daphealth.org forward slash pride for the full schedule of that weekend and all of the opportunities that are available to you. All right, Stephen, as always, we appreciate your time. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank you, Peter.